Okay, so today we're making a patio for these people. Uh, we're just clearing it off with a rake and all the pine needles and everything out. And it's gonna be uh, seven by seven foot. Um, we're gonna use redstone slabs and concrete to level it out. Um, so we're just gonna go ahead and get started clearing off all the, the pine needles first. All right, so we just got done clearing off all the pine needles. Um, and uh, we made it seven feet by seven feet. And we're just right now we're clearing out all the dirt so that we can put our forms in. Um, so once all this is cleared out, we'll start with our sand and get it level. So we'll go. Weatherman said it'd be sunny all day, so we went ahead and put sand and uh, concrete mix down, and then it started raining. So we'll go ahead and try to finish up here, just laying all the blocks out, put the spaces in between. Uh, so we'll go ahead and finish this up. All right, so we went ahead and finished putting all the tiles in and went ahead and took all the spacers out. Um, at this point, you know, it's the rain looks like it stopped. Um, so I think it's good, good to go ahead and put some mortar in between cracks. We're just gonna take a funnel, fill in all the lines and then sweep it off, make it level with a broom. And then after that, we're gonna let it sit. We'll take the forms out and be good to go. So right now we're just sweeping all the mortar mix inside the cracks, making sure it's all level. And uh, after that, we'll wash it off with a light mist just to get all the excess dust off the top of the tiles. Uh, and after that, it should be good to go. We'll let it rest, let it set. forms out uh, just taking all the rest of the dirt and filling it back in making it nice and level um, and it's pretty much good to go it turned out pretty good 